<laughs> All right. Let's do this. I wonder if Terry Akers is actually that guy that's been following you. The I whole don't time. think so. I think Terry Akers has gone off to the next location. Oh, another computer. Where? That? Oh, uh, that ain't gonna turn on. No. Um. That's a person. Looks like Wild got. You probably can interact with him and get some information. I'm trying to. Is there, he's alive. He's alive. He's alive. Hooked up to the weird fucked upness, but that's an alive person. Yeah, can you see he's breathing? Barely, yeah. Whew. I really wonder how long they've been alive then. Like, probably for centuries. Potentially a long time. Oh. That must be how Akers welcomed the crew. Yeah. The antenna. They mentioned you have to do something with the antenna. You uh -huh. might have to get in communication with the other um, I could believe that. Okay, and then they'll send you so someone over. Where is this antenna? Um, it was on the other side. I think was it? Direction. Yeah. Look up. I think it's that light up there. The angry looking one? Yeah, the one. Not the red one, but the one to the right of it. Um, that I don't think so, but. Hey, there's another interaction constant. That's the one from earlier. Are you sure? No, I'm not sure of anything. I don't think that's the one. Because that. you have to access, you have to fix the antenna, and I think it'll the signal thing will work. So you think that's the antenna up there? Yeah. That's a long drop. I don't disagree. I'm not sure I can get to it though. Careful, Simon. Careful. Yeah. Oh. I think you're supposed to go this way. Just avoid the drop. Nope. That is not the correct answer. Because I cannot jump that high. And the game lets you jump higher if it's on a path it likes. Every time our little buddy flies over me, I get freaked out for a quick second. Because the shadow looks ominous. So that looks like an antenna to me, personally. Um... Maybe we'll just go around the other side. Yeah, but he didn't give us an option to manipulate or that. I'm gonna have to log in before I can adjust it. Maybe you have to, yeah, you have to go in here. I've already been in here once, we didn't see anything, but now we know we're looking for something. And it's possible I can get that door open now. With the the one for the cabinet, we're pretty sure someone's corpse. Oh, inside. yeah, yeah, the, the, with the black yeah. blood coming out of it. Yep. <laughs> Or there'll be a monster in here now. Both of these are possibilities. Alright. No, no, I can't. Um. Let's. What pills are those, by the way? Oh. Land cards. Prescription medicine. Oh, oh, go back up. Go back up. It said what it was. Alprazolam. That's Xanax. Is that a real thing? Yeah, that's Xanax. Um. Someone's getting a little antsy in here. Evidently. I guess what I'm looking for is like. Wait, wait, that console. Right to your left. No. I'm looking for like numbers written down or something. Um. The game combination, 1610, 1000, 610. I don't think so. Wait, wait, exciting claim, Delta. 
I6I? Claim. Yeah. I... Any numbers? No, no numbers. Camera. Security camera. <coughs> that would be really interesting to access the. Uh... Don't think we get that option, but and I, I actually don't wrong. think this is Acre because Acre's removed his eyes. Yeah, I don't know. Or maybe he removed his eyes and walked over to the end, and I don't know. See if we could pull that fire extinguisher. Yeah, I don't know. At this point, we're. Just I can. See if we could use that against the. Uh... Oh, there's some gravity. I can throw it. See if you can, yeah throw it at the locker. The IAM that's highlighted, I'm trying to figure out. Oh, go back, go back. You're right, you're right. L O. Exciting to watch Delta claim. Fly. Fly. One, one, nine, one? Where do you see the 191? It kind of looks like that. Let's start to try. We got no better leads yet. That's true. Um, come on. Yeah, just need a few more. Hey, can you hear me? There's no Come nine. Here, when there's no zero. Yeah. Nice and easy. So we can't do the one six zero or the one thousand either. Hey, you know what? It's not working. Looks okay, right? Yeah. It'll do. There must be a reason we interact with them. Careful, Brand. Nice and easy. Let's just follow him for a second. Okay. Yeah, just need a few more. I think you had to go up near that easy. cliff and climb up to the top. I don't. This is the antenna. Yeah, just need a few more. Okay. I'd bet money on that being the antenna. Careful, Brad. Nice and Jimmy easy. Jimmy it somehow. Um. Yeah, just need a few more. I am. Catherine, you would be really useful right about now. Oh, what do you do? I don't know. Okay. Those are the directions of the... Um, the stations. Maybe we can get a signal yeah. there. So just pause it when you're over the line. Okay. And then the red one. Then just hang it and let it hang on the red one. We did some. What did you do? Oh. And then you have to dial a code when you have it aligned? I don't think so. <sighs> I honestly don't know, though, so... Hmm. There's a couple other rooms we didn't explore around here, I don't think. Oh, 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 four, nine. Okay, now, now, let's see if we can go back to one of the rooms. Oh, crap, I think we should have just left the antenna back there. Okay. Well, let's leave it there. Alright. See if we can interact with some computers. Well, so this one's not full of water, so... Oh, yeah, yeah the pressurizer room still works. Yeah. I think even the HQ is full of water still, isn't it? Yeah, but you can still access the computer. Yeah, might be that actually might be where you're supposed to get access the. 
Maybe. Give it a shot. Yeah, I mean, we're here. Might as well try this room, too. Yeah. It doesn't say corrupt opponent anymore. Yes, it does. Oh, no. Yeah, I know. It's the... <laughs> throw, throw, throw the fire extinguisher. I just want to see what happens. Oh. Aim's not that good. It's the flesh sound coming out of the fu out of that locker. That's the one you want to do. That's the weirdest part. Yeah, it's like, like clink, clink, clink. No, yeah. someone in there. <laughs> or someone's remains in there. Very much so. Alright, so... Oh, I thought he was attacking our friend. Um, so we did get that working. Let's go to HQ. Yeah, it can't hurt. Well, I'm gonna check out. The oh no, no, let's check out the station with the emails and stuff. Right. So go to back antenna. Remember, don't press circle. Transport active. Oh yeah, we got signal strength. We're talking to 049. Okay, so uh, Zeppelins. 049. Request transport. Zeppelin's on its way. Gotta get ready. Someone is coming. Well, well, we don't have the antenna or it's moving. It's coming towards us. Yes! We solved the puzzle we didn't know we were trying to fix. I like how the puzzles are challenging but not obnoxiously it's not hard. Up the ruffle sound. Sorry. I like how it's. I like how it's the puzzles are. Uh... Yeah, I like how the puzzles are challenging but not like. Either ridiculously easy or ridiculously obnoxious. Yeah. That's not ominous as shit looking. Yeah, you wanna hop on that, Charlie? No. That looks like a giant metapede. Calm down, we're safe. Oh, it's really disconcerting to existence like that. Where are we now? Delta. At least that's what you said before the crash. Oh, right. Of course. Is this a Zeppelin? Appropriately named. You think it can get us to Thea? It's a cargo transport. They use them for moving materials between the sites, anything that's too big for the shuttles. I'm sure it can carry us. Ugh, why won't it work? Come on. Oh, the tool chip is bust. Isn't that part of the Omni tool? Look who's been paying attention. We have to deal with that back at Upsilon. Then you know how it works. We need to get a new tool chip and switch it. Care to point me in the direction of the closest tool chip storage? I think it would be easier to just take one from a robot. What? Just knock a robot over the head and steal their chips? The toolbox over there says it has a stun baton. You could use that. Come on. I don't want to hurt anyone. Isn't this a bit much? It's just uh... a robot, Simon. We're just robots. Sort of. I'll get us a chip. No choice. Wait, isn't she in the chip? Um, a chip. Oh, should we get a weapon? We did get a weapon. Sweet. I don't think we have lots of ammo with this weapon. So, uh, let's go see if I can loot that corpse earlier. The one back there with the guy still alive? No, I found a dead robot earlier. Oh, yeah. So that way we don't have to kill the other guy. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe also our little friend might have something inside of it. But yeah, I don't want to kill our little friend. I am, yeah, I was going to say, I am far less likely to kill him than Dum Dum over here. Um, do you remember where it was? Yeah, it was by the bar. It was by. It was when we were walking around the rails. You were right. There, there we go. We just have to figure out how to find the chip. It's probably on the other side, maybe. 
Nothing's showing up. No, there, there's got to be a way. Whoa, oh, it, that's a target rectangle. Yep. So, well, aim the gun and see if you could look at the other robot with the. Yeah, he doesn't like that. Let's look at the uh, look at the robot, the um, the the dead one. I was aiming pretty much directly at it, man. That one. Yeah. What with the dead robot, or with it, the with the gun? It goes away. Oh, uh, right? okay. Yeah. See. Yeah, I see what you're saying. <clears throat> All right. So. Where's the malfunctioning robot, or whatever the hell it's called? Whatever you want to call it. Brandon? Is that what his name was? I can't remember if he was talking to Brandon, or... I don't remember. He called us Brandon, I think, at one point. Yeah. Um, where is he? Because I am not pulling the chip out of our tiny little helper friend. He got it. I think he's not as dumb as we thought, and he fled. <laughs> he overheard the conversation. No. Like, Fuck that. No. I'm just God damn it. We like ran into him everywhere we went, and now I'm he's not here. looking in the wrong locations now, too. Yeah, we haven't gone to these. All right, so that's the base. That's the antenna. He was by the antenna. He's probably over by the headquarters now. There he yeah, is. Let's talk to him one more time. Don't have that option. You okay? Oh, don't let him get away. I don't feel good about this. As well you should not. <laughs> this is giving me some like Bioshock. Whoa, you just throw that away? Yep. It made you do that? Yep. Oh man, there had to be a way we didn't have to kill him too. Well, he's, he's like, fuck you, you're some sick monster. In light language. Yeah, I don't think we made him happy. I... It was either him or the other one, so... Let's go Zeppelin the hell out of here. Thanks, Simon. Goodbye, my tiny Bye, useful man. friend and really guy who I had we, to straight up robot here. murder. Could you do it? Kill a robot like that? I get attached to them too. I'm not a monster. But in this case, it had to be done. He was talking. I mean, he was delusional, but he seemed sincere. Present. Yeah, well, I'm sure it's fine. Was he really that different from us? It's just beginning to sink in. I mean, really sink in. I'm a robot. Didn't we cover this already? I guess I've known ever since I woke up at Upsilon. I just keep suppressing it. Like my yes. brain doesn't want me to think about it. It's really getting hard not to think about it. Yeah. Could you maybe hit that switch over there so we could get moving? Oh, yeah, sure. A bit of a sociopath there. When did we establish actually that we were a robot? When she when she told that to us, and then I we guess yeah. remembered that like oh yeah we just kind of warped into like a water suit. Yeah. Thanks. I wonder if there really was a way. Like I wonder if there are ways you can go without killing these folks. No, I think the other option was kill our little helper robot. Well, yeah, without without killing anyone, we'll have as much positive karma as we can. I don't think there's a karma system in this game. There's ominous music. What if we could access those consoles? I can't. No. Okay. We really probably should have kept that stun gun. Just I don't think uh, the stun gun had any shots left in it. Like, I, it's... The game made me throw it away. I didn't have a choice on that one. Yeah. I don't disagree, but... Catherine, you're kind of a monster, too. I... This is all very much in the argument of survival, and... Okay, so... If we are a consciousness put into a machine, I don't think we're the only copy of that consciousness, in theory. Like, it... 
There's a literal arc That's of consciousnesses. There, yeah. So, I'm rationalizing this as the person we just killed was just a copy. probably one of a potential copy. Like, once you digitize someone's consciousness, you can just keep copying it, right? Like, you can just copy the file over and over. Unless you didn't, and that was the only copy, and uh, you just killed it. I don't think that's the case. That's great. Listening to other people when they talk because that's how conversations work. What? Oh, sorry. I just can't stop thinking about what we've become. It's kind of funny they mentioned the Mariana Trench. It's that we're no longer human. But then how can I feel like Simon? How can I feel like anything at all? I mean, technically, <laughs> I don't have the ears and no Christ, that's a weird thing to think about. I mean, I'm making sounds. I'm still saying things. You sure are. <sighs> okay. Your new body most likely has senses similar to those you had as a human. And your mind, only knowing one way to perceive the world, superimposes that skill set on top of your new features. So my mind is covering it up, pretending nothing's different. If it didn't, you'd probably be incapable of interacting with the world at all. And the stress would either kill you or make you go insane. So I've found a good balance between awareness and ignorance. Does that mean I shouldn't think about this stuff, or are my thoughts actually making me cool? Could I tip the balance by suddenly gaining some insight and then go insane? I wouldn't worry about it. I mean, we have real things to deal with. Saving mankind, remember? Speaking of which, we're closing in on Theta. I'll eject the Omni tool. As always, don't forget to take me with you. Uh, Kath, before you go, the artificial intelligence you mentioned in the escape vessel? Uh-huh, yeah, the warden... She raises a fair point. Yeah, that's true. The, the greater like good. This? I mean, it seems like something an unreliable AI would do. I suppose it set the ball in motion, but it's not directed with purpose. <laughs> it's really complicated to explain how machines think, Simon. Concentrate on getting inside data, okay? See you soon. See you soon. See you soon. Something Wicked Studios. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you give us a thumbs up down below, you share us with all your friends, and you subscribe to the channel. If you're looking for more videos right now, we've got a whole bunch of ones all over the channel. You can get to by the links below. If you hit the random button, I promise to send you to a good one. You know you want to. Press it. Press it. <laughs>